Welcome back, my dearest students, to the AP Biology course. Welcome to grade 11. I'm so happy and pleased to choose AP Biology with you guys. And inshallah, we will have a wonderful and fruitful year together. This year, we will be taking the AP Biology course. In, uh, in details, we will talk about each and uh, a small description about the AP units that are uh, going to be in your external exam. As we discussed last year about biology. We said that the American system uh, taking the AP course will have include a specific, um, a specific units in details in regards to specific subjects. We will go through each one of them in details. Uh, we will have the whole year, inshallah, until the end of March to be done from the, uh, the course as uh, the course description overall with the labs that, can super that will be supervised. As uh, we talked previously about biological concepts and uh, about organisms level analysis, the population and ecosystem. We will go through also communication, responses to environment changes, also the energy flow between the ecosystems, factors that can affect them. In all in details, we will go through them. We will start with uh, uh, five periods per week about the AP courses. The AP course concludes um, eight units. This eight units is starting with unit one about the cell. Now, as we all talked uh, about in our previous course in biology, we will talk about the basic chemistry of the cells, the chemistry of the um, of organic molecules, cell structure and function also in details and how the cellular level of organization, the differences between prokaryote and eukaryotic cells and introduction to the nucleus and the ribosomes. Also, we will go through the cellular respiration, photosynthesis, these also in the plant cells. Also, we will come and talk about them in details. We will talk about the membrane, the endomembrane systems, the, in, the, uh, the capability of the molecule uh, to enter to the cells and uh, the amount of the uh, molecules that will exit the cell also. Uh, vacuoles, energy-related organelle, and the cytoskeleton in details. After that, we will go to the uh, membrane structure and function. Uh, about we will talk about the plasma membrane structure and function, the passive and uh, passive and active transport uh, across the membrane, the modification of the cell surface also. All in this unit, in unit one, which is the cell. Eventually, uh, we will talk about the metabolism, the energy transport, the energy flow between the cells, metabolic reaction and energy transformation, oxidation reduction reactions and metabolism. Before we go to the plant cell, plant cell as we uh, talk about and we will talk about in details also, plant cell it can be divided into two main uh, processes which is photosynthesis and cellular respiration. We will talk about the organism, the process of photosynthesis and the plant that can be able to convert solar energy into uh, solar energy using the sun or carbon dioxide uh, material the use of chemicals instead of the use of the um, uh, of the sun as an energy resources and other type of photosynthesis after that we will be done from the first unit which is the cell with the cellular respiration overview about the cellular respiration uh, how it's be done outside the mitochondria and uh, we will talk about fermentation with this, we will be done from unit one, which is the cell. AP courses consist of eight units. Each unit has at its own weight in AP, in AP exam. Also, we will go through each one of them in details, uh, how, how many marks for each unit and what is the main topic to be done or to be taught to gain the most about the most mark that, and the most mark that you can get. So after that, we will go to unit two, which is genetic basis of life. During this unit, we will talk about the cell cycle and cellular reproduction. We will go through meiosis and mitosis in details, the sexual reproduction, uh, what is the phases of meiosis, the phases of mitosis, the cell cycle also in details. Uh, then we will go to the, uh, to the genetics part, which is Mendelian inheritance and for George Mendel law, Mendel patterns of inheritance and non-Mendel patterns of inheritance. We will talk about the molecular biology, the genetic material, the DNA, the structure of DNA, the structure of RNA, the replication of DNA, gene expression as RNA and DNA, the transcription and translation process also in details. 
Yeah, uh, to be continued with them later, we will talk about the regulation of the gene expression between prokaryote and eukaryote cells and the errors that can occur during this, uh, uh, this regulation, which can cause the production of gene mutation. At the, end, we, at the end of this unit, we will talk about the DNA technology, biotechnology process, gene, gene therapy uh, in details. This will be discussed in the second unit, which is about the genetic basis of life. After that, we will go to the evolution. Evolution will talk about Darwin and evolution, how population evolved, uh, species and macroevolution, the origin of history of life, the economy, and these, uh, uh, these topics. We will go through them also in details about the microbial evolution, about viruses, bacteria, uh, protist evolution, fungi, and then we will be moving to grow uh, to uh, the plants evolution and uh, and animal evolution in plants evolution uh, we will start talking about the diversity the flowering plant the structure and organization of the flower nutrient and the transport uh, flowering plants how they control the growth of uh, uh, the growth of the plant and how they reproduce uh, moving as shifting to the uh, animal uh, to the animal uh, evolution and uh, diversity. We'll talk about the vertebrates and invertebrates, how do they differ from each other. Then we will, uh, as a part of the animal cell, as you know, we will talk about the human evolution. We will compare between animal and human, how do they maintain their homostasis, and uh, about the body system, circulation, cardiovascular system, lymphatic and immune system, digestive system, respiratory system, uh, body fluid regulation and excretory system, neurons and sense organs. This would to be uh, compared between animal and uh, human, uh, human uh, system. And to the end, we will have the last one, which is the last unit, uh, ecology. We'll talk about the population, ecology, community, and ecosystem, major ecosystem of biosphere and um, at the end, we will talk about the assessment policy, how we can use the AP your mock exam uh, as a reference to be for you before going to the ex to the external exam. I wish you all the best in your exam. Inshallah, we will have a productive year. Best of luck for all of you, and inshallah, we, we, we will uh, finish it on time, so you will have a plenty of time to revise it uh, to have a revision together. Thank you so much.